Hello, I'm Tenman432, and welcome to Mega Man Zero Three. You might ask yourself why I'm making this series already. Usually, I take a super long break before making a new YouTube video, and the answer is it's summer vacation. But anyway, let's just get into the game with this uh, nice plot um, summary so far. The legendary Reploid Zero awoke from a long slumber. With Seal's resistance, he defeated Copy X, the ruler of Neo Arcadia. The terror of the Neo Arcadian regime ended, but the energy shortage remained a constant problem. Alright, that was Mega Man Zero One. Seal devoted herself to researching new forms of energy, and El Paizo became the newly appointed resistance leader. Okay, and Mega Man Zero Two now, which I just finished. However, overcome by his desire for power, El Paizo awakened the Dark Elf whose magic had once nearly destroyed the world. Yes, that happened. El Paizo, thirsting for the power of the Dark Elf, lost sight of his true duty, and was finally defeated after a fierce battle. However, the Dark Elf fled, her destination unknown. Yep, that was the ending. Mega Man Zero Two. The battle over the Dark Elf had only just begun. <laughs> All right. Two months later. Snowy. Those are sharp looking ice crystals. I don't know. I didn't notice those until now because they were in the background. Oh well. It sure is quiet. There haven't been many Neo Arcadian attacks lately. Things are almost too peaceful now. Miss Seal completed her research on the new energy. And if it solves the energy crisis, Neo Arcadia won't have a reason to fight us anymore. Actually, I already informed Neo Arcadia about this new energy, the SEAL system, but I haven't received a reply yet. Don't worry, I'm sure their answer, uh, their answer will come soon. There's no more reason to fight. We can live in peace, right? We're in the middle of a mission, so put a lid on it and walk. Wow, oh, a little harsh, Zero. Sorry. <laughs> That would be Seal, but I answered a few seconds late. The reading is getting stronger. We're close. What's that thing in the background? The snow is letting up. Okay. Wow! Look at that! Now you get a cool kind of 3D effect. Is that... Some kind of ship? Miss Seal, did that huge thing fall from outer space? Yes, but what's more, it's giving out the same energy reading as the Dark Elf, of which there is only one in the whole world. Zero was, was against the idea, but I had to find out what could possibly go be going on here. I wonder. New Arcadia has the area ahead of us condoned off cordoned off. I don't know. What? You guys stay here until I make sure it's safe. Okay. Be careful, Zero. Alright. Here we go. Finally getting into the gameplay after about four and a half minutes. But anyway, a uh, cool thing about Mega Man Zero 3 uh, and 4, I guess. Uh, you do not have to upgrade your weapons anymore. They are... From the start, once you, as soon as you get them, they are fully upgraded with the charge shots and everything. So no more worrying about that. And uh, yeah, I guess you already spent two games upgrading your items and Capcom knows that uh, they wouldn't want to make a third, right? Anyway, uh, yeah, I just skip out through there. And uh, I just didn't read all that text. She knew who I was. 
Why would the elf who almost destroyed the world know me? Zero, are you there? Maintain radio silence. The enemy is near. Oh, I'm I'm sorry. Get down! New Arcadians! Miss Sale, look out! I, I, I don't know, I just completely changed the accent. Oh no! What happened to them? No! I mean, I mean, I mean, no! I, I don't know how to do that. Relax, they won't come to any harm. Harpuya? I'm letting you off the hook this time. But you and those resistance fighters must leave. Now. You're letting us off the hook? Scram! I don't have time to mess with you now. Shwoop. Dot da dot. Zero, can you hear me? Seems you're okay. Leave the rest of this up to me. I want you all to head back to the Resistance base. But Zero... I've heard that voice somewhere before. Is it calling me? Oh, I'm sorry about this voice acting. That really wasn't my best there. Anyway, um, we're on with the stage. You might notice these little uh, floppy disk looking things. And um, yeah, they are Mega Man Zero 3's main version of collectible items. So what they do is uh, some of them contain like energy crystals, or uh, cyber elves, like in the other games, and uh, some of them contain cool information um, things about bosses or historical events or whatever, and uh, or other characters you might meet in Resistance Base even. I believe they usually will give you their little floppy disks. Or actually they're called secret disks, so um, yeah. Also, enemies drop them, and they're usually information about that specific enemy. And, uh, yeah, those, that's those things. So anyway, this stage is, is pretty simple. Intro stage. Um, you know, should be pretty easy. Not need too much explaining. And we're already at the boss, so, yeah. Hey, it's, uh, Fairy Leviathan and Fafnir. Now you're asking for it! Yeah! I'll blast you to pieces! Pew pew pew! pew. Oof! <laughs> Ooh, who's that dude? Pant, pant. Are you alive, Fafnir? What a monster! The two of us fighting together and not a scratch? Omega, the evil reploid banished from Neo Arcadia. He's pretty tough. Hey, it's Zero. Zero? What the heck are you doing here? What is that thing? That's Omega. His mere existence defies reality. He's strong, but... He's not as fun to fight as you are. Hee <laughs> hee. I don't feel like fighting him, so he's all yours. See ya, Zero. You can't just teleport that well. Bah! That Leviathan! <sighs> I can't move! We'll have to finish this another time. Hey, Zero! I'll get you and that Omega one of these days. Don't you dare die before then, Zero. So this is the Omega? From the ending? Secret ending? Omega, huh? So you were the one who called me here? Okay, I guess we're not gonna wait for him to answer. Let's just fight him. So anyway, this is the opening boss for the stage. So it is a relatively simple. So Omega likes to fire these bouncy laser ball things, and he also does this, where his hands shoot out little laser circles, and you can just dash under them and stuff. But since you already have the charge shots, it's pretty simple. Grr. Alright, you gonna explode now? Because that was really easy. Oh? Oh, his arms came back. You just don't give up, do ya? Oh. It's getting shocking. Garl. <laughs> so, you're Omega. I'm afraid I can't let you leave this place. 
ever. Time for your destruction. Hiya. And hi. Hi. Oh, well. <laughs> Omega, that will be quite enough. Huh? From this day onward, you will have a fight with this person as a new Arcadian. It's not polite smashing a friend like that. Garl. Lord. Wile. A new Arcadian? Who is this guy? He's floating. Oh well. <laughs> I am Wile. You may call me Dr. Wile. You must know my name, Harpuya of the Four Guardians. And you, the legendary hero, Zero. Zero the hero. Oh. Dr. Wile, you're kidding me. It can't be. Why are you, why are, who, are you who was banished from New York Acadia a century ago? With Omega? That's simple. I, I brought him. What? M Master X, is that you? Man, so many plot twists and truths being revealed in the first opening five minutes. Harpuya, <laughs> you haven't ch changed. And then there, there's... I missed you, you Zero. You must be. You're a copy, aren't you? Hehehe. <laughs> I brought back Master X, whom you defeated long ago, to protect humanity from the chaos of this world. Wile saved my life. I owe him, you see. I I'll take Omega back, to thank you. Harpuya, you could keep searching for the Dark Elf. Omega and the Dark Elf. We'll need them for what's to c c come. What is to come? But Master X, think how many humans died because of the Dark Elf and Omega, both created by this man. How can you justify exposing humanity to such a grave danger, especially now with the energy crisis almost solved? What's this? Are you trying to tell Master X what to do? When did you grow so bold, Harpuya? Wow, you. So, Zero, you, you guys also searching for the Dark Elf, right? Let's m make a contest out of it. I'll sh show you who the real hero is. Well, Mega Man X, you got double the amount of games, main games, than Zero. Oh well. Let's see how far you get with that body. <laughs> that body? What do you mean? With that body? Didn't I just say that? Oh. Zero, this is terrible. So you were monitoring that whole thing? Hurry back to the base. Operator? Commencing trans. Alright, that's the end of our mission, and here's the new results screen. You may notice um, that other, next to the total, there is an average, and uh, since I got 100 this round, my average is 100. So if I get a really low score, the average helps um, keep my score up. Um, but it also brings down the average. It, it's an average, you know, if you know how those work. Anyway, there's also these secret discs here. Some of them you can analyze, only the ones with uh, e-crystals and cyber elves in them, and the other ones contain information, like I was talking about, about the enemies and bosses and other things like that. Anyway, back to base. What should I do? Well, for now, not letting New Arcadia have the Dark Elf. That'd be priority one number one. I'll calculate the best source of action. I don't know. I I, I read it too slowly. Oh well. Miss Steele, please cheer up. Everyone, everything's turned out all right before, hasn't it? That's right. We believe in you, Miss Steele, and in Mr. Zero too. Thank you, everyone. All right. Looks like they changed the new resistance base. The simulation will take a little while to longer to. <laughs> A little while longer to finish, but you should get a little rest first. For now, I'll save your data. Okay, let's do that. I'll take care of managing the data, just like always. If you need anything, let me know. One more thing, you should go see Shereview. I heard he's finished his secret disk analyzer. If you find any secret disks that you want to analyze, ask Shereview to have a look for you. Okay, that was a lot of reading. Anyway. Uh, new resistance base, the command room, 
It's nicer now. There's not that huge tower thing um, that the El Paiso stand up from, and you can jump on the walls, so that's just amazing. Let's talk to this guy. I don't remember his name. Did you get your new weapon from Sereview? If not, you should... I'm, I'm really skipping through this text way, way too fast. Anyway, um, into Sereview's room. I never pronounced his name right. Anyway, you can see he has a secret disc. That's all his information. Hey, Zero, are you alright? I heard the news. Despite the new energy, the world is still not at peace. I, I never thought it would be easy, but uh, anyway, I just finished a new weapon for you. Um, I also fixed your shield boomerang. Here, take it. Da -ding. Da -ding. Oh, uh, one more thing about about secret discs. Uh, secret discs contain things that you can't decode, right? Well, I can analyze them for you, so stop by any time. You can also talk to me if you ever want to analyze the contents of a disc that you've already analyzed. I don't think I read that right because he said I analyzed twice anyway. Uh, we're being called to the commander's room, so yeah, let's go there. Hmm? Zero, they're asking for you. This real the recoil rod looks easy to use. Thanks. The world is too much for Seal to bear alone. Take good care of her, Zero. Alright. So, um, yeah, let's head back there. Or maybe I can just walk around like that. Anyway, let's show you how the secret disk system works. Um, the ones that are dark, um, I've already read and stuff. And these ones, um, some of them contain, like, this information that I was talking about. And that one contained a cyber elf. Um, anyway, uh, maybe I'll manage to get most of these sometime. And then I'll look at all the information in another episode. Maybe a bonus episode. But, um... Yeah, that's the basic of how this um, secret disk system works. But yeah, we'll get back to this another in another episode, part, whatever you want to call it. And uh, anyway, let's go back to the commander room. But not before I show you the recoil rod. Um, like the other rods, you can fire in most of the directions. And uh, with this one, you can hit the ground and it recoils. So you fly up when you use the charge shot. Um, it can also break a few objects, and also we have the shield boomerang. And you can still use this to do an alt uh, boomerang circle forever. Anyway, back to the commander's room. Sorry this took so long, Zero. Are you ready? We stimulated our options based on the information at hand. I've had the results prepared in the form of missions. The first two are missions to prevent New Arcadia getting the Dark Elf. The other two are guerrilla attacks on New Arcadia. To protect everyone from its threat. Dot dot. Zero. Is fighting our only option? I mean, we've developed this new energy. I thought the world would finally be at peace. Do we really have to keep fighting? Seal. You're already doing the best you can, and you're not alone. Leave the rest to us. Zero. Mr. Zero, we're ready. You can leave at any time. Select a mission? Alright. <laughs> Change the voice. Whenever you're ready, just let me know. Anyway. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to end this episode here before we take too long. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. And, uh... Yeah, that's all I can really say other than like and subscribe, but I'm not gonna say that because all YouTubers say that and I wanna be unique. Anyway, uh, peace and sheep. See you in the next episode. Should've said peace and sheep last. And see you in the next episode first. Anyway, peace and sheep.